This video explains the peer review publication process. Peer refers to expert scholars who share the same field of study. They are most often university professors who teach and conduct research. Review refers to what these expert scholars contribute to the peer review process. They evaluate other scholars' research publications for accuracy, innovation, and scholarly standard. Peer review ensures that scholars, from students to professors, can access and use high-quality research. Let's walk through the peer review process. Professor Alexis Jordan is a psychology scholar. She has conducted research on children's language acquisition through play. Now it's time to write a paper about the results. In her paper, Professor Jordan writes about her research project. Professor Jordan also finds and cites relevant information from research other scholars have done on the subject. She does this to show how she has built her research on that of other scholars. When Professor Jordan has completed her paper, she sends it to the editor of a scholarly journal that publishes papers related to her research. The editor either rejects the paper or decides to submit it for peer review. The editor decides Professor Jordan's paper is strong enough to be sent on for blind peer review. This means the editor sends it to other scholars who don't know who wrote the paper. The peer reviewers, who are also child psychology scholars, evaluate Professor Jordan's paper. Then the reviewers have three choices for the paper, reject, accept, or accept with revisions. Very few papers are accepted without revisions. The peer reviewers send their recommendations and comments back to the editor. If the paper needs revisions, the editor sends it back to Professor Jordan with the reviewer's comments. Professor Jordan doesn't know who the peer reviewers are. This makes the review process double-blind. This process might go back and forth several times until the paper meets the standards acceptable for academic scholarship. When Professor Jordan's paper is fully accepted, it is published in the journal that has peer-reviewed it, along with other peer-reviewed papers by scholars in the same field. When you're a student, you're a scholar too. Like your professors, you write papers. You decide on a topic and conduct research on that topic. In your paper, you write about your own ideas, and you also cite relevant information from peer-reviewed papers and other scholarly material. You do this to show how you have built your research on that of other scholars. Your work isn't peer-reviewed, but it is reviewed and evaluated by your professor. Here's a peer review bonus tip. There are several ways to determine if a publication is peer reviewed. When you're searching, look for these words. Peer reviewed, refereed, scholarly. You can also look up the journal website and its publishing process. You can do this through a search engine like Google or Yahoo. The peer review process. It's a quality control system for scholarly publications and it ensures that your own research is informed by credible sources.